Hi Kindergarten! Today we're going to be exploring numbers. We're going to look at different ways we can show or represent a number. Here we have the number 3. We can use the word to represent 3. We can also use dice. We can use our fingers or a tens frame. We can even use blocks or teddy bear counters. There are so many ways to represent the number 3. Can you think of any more? Let's try representing the number 4. Can you hold up 4 fingers? Great job! Do you know which word says 4? That's right! F-O-U-R spells the number 4. Which tens frame shows the number 4? Well done! The tens frame on the right has four dots. Which dice shows four? That's right. The dice on the left represents the number four. Which tower has four blocks? The tower on the right has four blocks. Let's look at the number six now. Can you hold up six fingers? Is there more than one way to show six fingers? Yes, there is. You could hold up five fingers and one finger, four fingers and two fingers, or three fingers and three fingers. There are three different ways to show the number six using your fingers. Do you know which word spells six? That's right. Which of these tens frames shows the number six? Two of the tens frames shows six. Which plate has six apples? That's right. The plate on the left has six apples. Okay, Kindergarten, it's your turn now. Roll a dice, or two, and see which number it lands on. Try and show that number in lots of different ways. Remember, you can use the numeral, word, fingers, a tens frame, blocks, or counters. Have fun! Music